just wanted to share with you uh, how efficient, fuel efficient the Prius Echo 2019 really is or has been to me at the very least. Uh, you can see as I'm showing you here in the dashboard as I am safely driving how uh, I am driving at an average of right now of about 71.5 or 0.6 miles per gallon average and I've driven about 200 miles uh, of course that average changes as you drive more or less miles and uh, depending on your uh, driving style your aggressiveness in driving and all this good stuff but I got to tell you on average I've been getting pretty close to this uh, you know consistently for many months now uh, it's been from 65 and up 65 miles per gallon and up this car is EPA rated at about 58 gallons per mile excuse me miles per gallon 58 miles per gallon uh, but I've been getting a whole lot more than that I've had this car uh, for close to two and a half years now since 2019 is now uh, you know August 2021 I've had it since late 2019 December to be exact actually November uh, late November to be exact so I've had it to close to two and a half years and I've been getting very, very good my mileage. Uh, so I just wanted to share this. I wanted to recommend uh, this vehicle. If you are looking for a fuel efficient vehicle, whether it's for work, whether it's uh, for personal use, for traveling, I am using it for uh, work right now doing uh, calls business all kinds of uh, work electronics electrical installation uh, it does have a lot of cargo space I uh, thought about about getting a van but I'm getting such a good mileage from this car I would never get from any van no matter how small the engine on that van is even if it's a four cylinder I will never ever get anywhere close to the uh, efficiency this car gives me if uh, if I get about 25 26 27 miles per gallon on any other vehicle I'll, I would be surprised um, this vehicle right here just look at what uh, shows on the dashboard 71.7 Yes, I do drive it easy. I do drive it uh, consciously, trying to save gas, trying to extend my range. Uh, of course, I am very uh, green-minded, I would say. Uh, very efficient, efficiency-minded, very um, cautious when it comes to spending money. Uh, and this is on the cheap gas. Uh, I put nothing but the low octane gas. I did a study not long ago, a trial where I tried the premium gas to see if I get uh, a lot more mileage to where it's uh, where I could pretty much uh, justify the higher cost of the gas, but. Reality, I get pretty close to about the same. Maybe I get about 10% more, 12% more. When the price difference is about 25 or 30% uh, between the low octane and the high octane gas. So to me, it's not justifiable to buy the uh, higher octane gas. You may have a different uh, approach or mentality when it comes to that because there is other or there are other advantages of putting premium gas I believe especially with the you know they claim they're clean it's cleaner uh, keeps your engine cleaner but I really don't think even if it's true the price
price difference, the offset that you spend every year, every month, every few years, or, you know, especially if you think about the life of the vehicle or the time that you keep the vehicle, I don't think that price difference, the cost difference is worth it. Cost that you're gonna spend on the higher gas, higher priced gas, which is sometimes 30 to 40 percent higher. And between the, uh, you know, yes, you may keep your engine a little cleaner, a little better looking, a better, a little maybe a little better running, but considering the entire life of the vehicle, you may. Be you may get maybe like like what one more year out of the vehicle two more years maybe you get maybe five hundred dollars more when you sell it it's just not worth it when you're spending thousands of dollars more uh, on gas uh, especially you know looking at it uh, from a the life of the vehicle all the time the entire time that you keep a vehicle and run it and drive it it's just not worth it so, I highly recommend this vehicle if you're uh, really looking for fuel efficiency. I don't think it gets any better. Uh, the next thing, the next best thing would be pretty much um, getting an electric vehicle if you're uh, thinking about complete uh, eradication of using the fuel. I mean, if you don't want to use fuel at all, then the next best thing would be electric. Um, the Prius Prime does get better mileage uh, than this one. It is, however, a lot more costly. Uh, they are less available. I was initially looking for a Prius Prime, but uh, none was available in my area. I had to go very far and pay a whole lot more for uh, that vehicle so I uh, ended up deciding on just this one here which I'm very happy with and you know I'm getting what I wanted which is extreme fuel efficiency thank you very much uh, I would like to hear your experience and comments if you have or have had one of these vehicles or thinking or thinking about getting one of these vehicles I would like to hear your comments or to read your comments. Thank you very much. Have a great day.